Let us now take the second model from this topic which is based on the property of product of LCM and HCF of two numbers. Let us understand the point here. For any two positive numbers A and B, A into B will be equal to L into H where L is the LCM of the numbers A and B and H is the HCF of the numbers A and B. So as you can see here the product of two numbers, the product of any two positive numbers will always be equal to the product of their LCM and HCF. So examination point of view out of these four variables any three would be given to us and we are supposed to find out the fourth one. So by substituting the values at the proper places we can find out the required answer. Let us take an example to understand this. Let us now take an example on the concept of a into b equals to l into h where a and b are any two positive integers and l and h are LCM and HCF of those two numbers. The question here is the LCM and HCF of two positive numbers are 300 and 30 respectively. If one of the numbers is divided by 4 the quotient is 15 then what is the other number? So as given in the question the LCM is 300 and the HCM of two positive numbers is 30. So we can say that L is equal to 300 and H is equal to 30. If one of the numbers is divided by 4 the quotient is 15. Let us say one of the numbers is A. So as given in the question when A is divided by 4, A by 4 the quotient is 15. That means A when divided by 4 the answer is 15. So from this we can say that A will be equal to 15 into 4 that is equal to 60. Then what is the other number? So we are supposed to find out the other number B. Let us take it as B. Now as discussed here we know that A into B should always be equal to L into H. So A is nothing but 60 into B should be equal to the LCM is 300 into HCF is 30. So 30 gets cancelled 2 times and 2 here goes 150 times. So we can say that the other number B is equal to 150. So this is how we can use the property A into B equals to L into H to solve such questions.